Hey Siri, play Taylor Swift on Spotify. Now playing this is Taylor Swift from Spotify. This is how to use Siri to control Spotify. I'm Josh Smith with GuidingMobile.com. The first thing you need to do is install iOS 13 or higher and then update the Spotify app. This is new as of October 7th. From there, you can activate Siri, play Taylor Swift on Spotify. The first time that you do this, it will ask to access your Spotify data. You can either respond with a yes or you can tap yes. Once you do that, it's going to pull up and start playing music on Spotify. There's a variety of things that you can do with Siri and Spotify. Play This Is Blink-182 on Spotify. So you're gonna be able to play playlists that you create or that Spotify creates. You can play specific songs. Play Can I Get a Witness in Spotify. So you can also use this to play a specific song title. Play Swimming on Spotify. Now you can also play an album just by saying that album name had pretty good success using Siri to control Spotify so far. I've had some issues controlling the daily mixes and some of these unique playlists, and I can't access any of the podcasts, but I use podcasts in a dedicated app, so it's not a huge deal. I expect that the overall control and capabilities will get better as I learn how to use Siri on Spotify and as they fine tune the adjustments and as they fine tune the control. If you have any issues with this, you may need to uninstall and reinstall the app and then make sure that you've given Spotify access. If you need to go into settings, you can go into settings and then find Spotify in your apps. It's right down here at the bottom for me. And then tap on Siri and search and make sure you've offered access to your Spotify data through Siri. If you found this video useful, please give us a thumbs up. That helps us out. Subscribe for more from Gotta Be Mobile. Thanks for watching and have a great day.